I think it's really important to have hobbies at a, at a young age because you have the world ahead of you and if you can taste and try several different hobbies, you might find something that you really fall in love with. All the guys that we kind of hung out with and met there at school, they all skated and a lot of them played in uh, punk bands. So after we would skate, then they would have band practice and then I would go hang out at the band practice and then there was like my access to being able to pick up a guitar and play this thing that I've always, I thought for a long time it would be so cool to learn and to, to be able to do and there was my opportunity. To me music is the ultimate expression and every time I would be on <clears throat> some kind of trip or just vibing with a Walkman or something like that, it was always music that I always, you know, kept the vibes going. You would be at the camp spot or the skate spot and there was always music that was pumping and I just always was, was drawn to music in general to, to create a vibe, you know, so naturally it, it developed into wanting to play it and wanting to give back other people that same energy, you know. My brother kind of encouraged me to go to the next step and uh, like noodle around on his guitar because he had a guitar but it, it, was, it wasn't very eventful and then so it wasn't until my mom actually signed, signed us up in junior high for uh, guitar lessons, me and Jonathan. Once I got the technical abilities to like actually learn more songs that I wanted to play, that's when it started getting fun. The music stuff started happening in junior high where I did like after school program with guitar. That, that got the initial interest in the music. And from there, I didn't really want to continue with guitar, so I went to drums in high school. And that's what I've stayed with ever since. No matter what, if you just stick to it, my father taught me, if you just stick to something for 10 years and you just keep doing it nonstop, something will happen, you know, especially if you're passionate about it. You know, if you're not passionate about something 100%, mm, I don't think anything's gonna really happen. But if you're passionate, and you believe in yourself and you're confident, yes, it can, you can do anything you want. It's being uh, enthusiastic and, and I guess driven in the sense of you gotta do it, you know? That's what happens with me with all of my interests. It's just it comes to a point where I just gotta do it. <laughs> I don't know what's gonna happen, but I just gotta do it. Just being out and about and not being cooped up in the house and dealing with some fucking internet bullshit, you know what I mean? At least you're fucking out there getting it, you know? And that's the premises of all of it, you know what I mean? To just get out and get it, basically. It's important to find out what your interests are, and then it's just stay excited, because that's what'll drive and fuel the development of it.